Hello. How are you? How are you feeling today? I just wanted you to know that I'm proud of you. I know that the past couple of days, weeks and months has been very challenging. I know that when you started 2024, you had a lot of hope. You had a lot of aspirations. You actually thought that this year was going to be different. You knew within your soul that this year was the year you were going to finally feel like you were doing something with your life. But here we are in October and it seems as if every dream you ever wanted to achieve has just gone down the drain and you feel defeated. And you're telling yourself that another year has come and you're lost. I want to tell you that you've done well for fighting the battles that you fought. From overcoming the experiences that you've you've experienced. You are one brave person. And I'm so proud of you that in spite of the fact that life seems to be throwing every kind of obstacle your way you are still here you're still breathing you're still waking up every day even if it's hard you're fighting not just for yourself but for your family for your loved ones i know i know sometimes it feels like you don't even want to be here but because you don't want your family to be sad you're still fighting and today i'm just coming on your timeline to just let you know that I am proud of you. You are doing so well. You are doing more than you give credit for yourself for. And I just want you to know that just as you were able to overcome every trial and temptation and obstacle that was thrown your way in the previous years, you are going to overcome again this time. And it's not for nothing. It's not in vain. It's not a waste of your life. Everything that you're going through is preparing you, is is helping to shape you to become the person that God has destined for you. So you're not wasting your life. You're not stuck. You're not useless. You are important. Your life matters. There are people who love you. There are people who care about you. There are people who wake up with joy in their hearts because they know you. It may not seem like so, but I'm here to remind you that you are important. So please keep fighting. Please keep believing. Please keep holding on. No matter what, please don't give up. Continue to hold on. Even if this year comes and it feels like you didn't accomplish anything, the fact that you made it to the end and you're alive, that is something worth celebrating. That is something worth to be proud of. Please don't give up. God has something special, purposeful just for you. It doesn't matter if it looks like the people around you are living their life. Trust me, a lot of people are faking it. But you, you are your authentic self. So don't let others distract you. Everybody has their own journey. Everybody has their own timeline. Someone married at 25 and divorced at 30. You're single because maybe God is preparing someone special for you that you would grow old with. So be patient. Somebody bought a house at 20 and lost it at 30. But maybe God is preparing a a household for you that's not just going to be a house but a home for you and your family. So don't look at what looks like other people doing better than you. Your journey is different. Your journey is unique. Continue to hold on. Continue to trust God. And if you ever, ever doubt it, remember this video. I'm proud of you and you're going to make it. I promise you, you will. Take care.